Hello, this is the last day uh, that I'm going to be on Ramon Margalef, which is the name of the ship where I am now. I'm not sure I have told you this before. And uh, we are already going towards the port, it's going towards Rijon. We can already see land. I don't know if you can see, I guess you can see land. I did not have the opportunity yet to show you around because the first days I was quite seasick and not feeling very well, so was Teresa and most of the people around the sea was quite rough. And also on the other days I was just working a lot. So, but now I have some free time until we are in land so I can show you a bit around. So behold the front of the ship. Yeah, that's the front of the ship. I have to say that the cruise was a success. So we collected the uh, everything we wanted to collect we did all the experiments we wanted to do and i think most of the people managed to and we did all stations sometimes in the cruise it's not possible if the weather is very bad uh, or something happens we are not capable of, uh, of uh, doing all the stations that we want and we've even arrived are arriving half a day before it was foreseen so yeah so here is the back of the ship. So this is where I was towing my net, so you probably have seen it already. Here is the CTD room. Here is the CTD again, which you have already seen as well. And now let's go towards the interior. Oh, it is a wavy. <laughs> filming <laughs> and down here are all the rooms and I'm not gonna show you inside all the rooms but I will show you inside mine so here we go my and Teresa's room and guess who's here <laughs> and uh, I just realized there's not much of the ship to show. I think I showed everything. So actually, more or less, this is it. <laughs> there's not much more to show. Um, I hope you enjoyed this really fast. Do you want to see the bathroom? I'm not sure. It's saying it's very interesting when I show Okay, uh, sh the bathroom. So it's a normal bathroom, <laughs> and it has. It's quite a challenge to have a shower without making everything wet which doesn't normally happen. Everything is wet after like one second of showering. And not to fall down. And not, <laughs> I, I slipped. I slipped here, coming out of the bathroom and I just like, whoa, <laughs> slow-mo. <laughs> and fell on the floor, basically. Um, are we allowed to show the kitchen? Not really. We also have a place where we eat, okay, but now it's closed, so. And people are looking at me like crazy. Like, yeah, what is she doing? Because I have this thing and I'm We're on land. No, we are not on land. We are still on <laughs> the ship. The land is there. I don't lie. <laughs> there is the land. Yeah. And here's the ship. Really so we are now going on land after two weeks of shaking this. What are your impressions, Teresa, about the of cruise? The cruise it was me. awesome. It was interesting <laughs> to live on the ocean. In the ocean. On the ocean. <laughs> For such a long time. Can't we speak anymore. Living. No, but I mean, I'm quite happy to be on land again now. Yeah. I mean, it was nice, but it's now nice again to be on land. Yeah, yeah, it was a lot of like work. Exactly. A lot of work, and the last two days were a bit of too much free time on this very small working trip. Yeah. But yeah, the thing about, cruise, nice. work, uh, about these cruises is that they are really just made for working. So there's no... Mm, so not yet, every, Okay, but, but not the small. small, small but cruises. these no, normal, the normal ones. Yeah, the normal so ones. Yeah, yeah. special. Yeah. They are made for just work. work. And fun so fun there's no fun. like uh, leisure activities. So yeah, if you're not working, you're basically just wandering around. <laughs> now the moment. <laughs> Almost. Steps, few steps, few steps. On land! <laughs> we are in Gijon. So we arrived with the ship and now we came to a hotel in Gijon for one night. 
and now we are leaving to the airport and I am going back to Vienna. So this is the end of my journey and of the research cruise and uh, now going back home. So I did not really get to do a video of all the steps, but basically the only thing we had to do once we arrived on port was to pack everything, put every like the samples we have to put them in dry ice so that they keep cool. Then they are were transported to the lab of our partners, and then we will just send like a someone to collect the samples and bring them to Vienna so that we can start working on them. So this is it. I we will now go to the airport. So see you at the airport. I am back in my room one week after I am back from the cruise because now I was editing my video and I realized that I did not film anything at the airport that I thought I did. So I need to kind of give a end to my story. So this is, was the last video of my expedition adventure on the research vessel and if you have watched all the other videos I hope you enjoyed them and I really hope that you understand a bit what kind of work we can do on these research cruises. It was a lot of fun to do this, it was a lot of fun to film and it was a lot of fun to edit and uh, I also hope you enjoyed it. So see you later. I I'm just gonna stop this.